Yeah, I want to thank my panel. Our coverage continues right now. It's about 10 p.m. Uh, here in Manhattan, where the, by this time next Tuesday night, if the schedule holds, Donald John Trump, child and product of New York, will officially be defendant in a New York criminal matter. In our exclusive interview last hour with former Vice President Pence, here's some of what he told CNN's Wolf Blitzer about today's historic indictment. When you have an attorney general in New York and a Manhattan DA that targeted one particular American in their campaigns, I think that offends the notion of, of the overwhelming majority of the American people who believe in fairness, who believe in equal treatment before the law. And this appears to be just one more example, Wolf, of the kind of two-tiered justice system that uh, the American people have had enough of. But that's the former vice president in our last hour, in this hour of our live breaking historic coverage, a conversation with the one figure who has been key to first the scandal, then the investigation, and now the charges against former President Donald Trump, his old boss, Michael Cohen, former Trump attorney and fixer, who himself paid Stormy Daniels the money that is apparently at the center of this indictment. First, though, the very latest on the history made in Lower Manhattan tonight and the planned pushback from Team Trump.